Hello and happy gaming everybody and say good morning to the birds too. They are just they're having the time of their lives right now. Hey guys. Got yeah, birds. Alright. So we're now back to this and I need to figure out where in the world do I go from here. There's so many places that I can that I can go, sort of. I have no clue where exactly I'm supposed to be going. And strangely, doing that is faster than just walking. The backstabbing isn't doing the job. So don't get me wrong when I say this, I very much enjoy playing, enjoy playing Wizard of Oz, but sometimes it is nice just to, just to step out and do something a different. And as much, fun, as much fun as I do have playing around with new builds and testing new ideas, like, I have, to, I have to be honest, only playing one game at a time is... I mean, not disheartening, that's not the right word for it. Again, I like playing Wizard of Legend. But it really... It really gets a little, gets a little samey doing it all the time. Like, having that be my only game, so... Hopefully a lot of you are okay with me, kind of... Kind of slipping on the old, the old blood-stained pants, or in this case, the bloodless dress. Stop it! Yeah. Hey, you heard the woman. Stop, Stop. it. Level up. But I am curious as to what the impetus was for doing the, for doing the bloodless as a playable character thing. I mean, it's a fine gesture, don't get me wrong. I'm very happy about it. But I'm curious as to where that idea came from. Did the guys at 505 get yeah. this suggestion a lot? Yeah. Kind, of, kind of makes me think that there was something there that they said, you know what, that's a good idea. And since it's taking us a while to finish what we're what we've been working on, just because of you know, the global pandemic and all the trash that goes along with that, it's a garbage situation for everyone. Make no mistake. Celeste, room. hi Celeste. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we have here. Last. Sustenance. <sighs> Scarlet Cycle. Now, I wonder if, if that Celeste has an actual identity, oh, hello, Savory, or if that's meant to be a callback to the actual game, Celeste. You know, that lovely little indie game, indie game gem that came out a few years ago? Still love that game, and actually, I was thinking about going back and doing another yeah. playthrough of it. Yeah. Abyssos? I don't know, Bloodless. Are we scared of this dragon? Scarlet 
Alright, that was not difficult. Just to finish filling out the map. Very nice. Hey, now where the hell am I going? You know, it's been a while since I played Bloodstained. Hall of Termination. Coming up on you a little faster. Sorry, Queen of the Pavers. I need the experience points. Ow. Scarlet Wolf. Alright, so there's plenty to explore here. That's right, birds. Actually, that's pretty specifically Riku. Love that. Save every chance you get, because you never know what sort of crazy shit will happen next. For what it's worth, this is also an indie game gem, but... This is not a puzzle platformer, I guess. Celeste is more of a precision platformer, not really a puzzle platformer. Arc Demon! Slap the crap out of that guy. That's what you deserve. More fairies. I don't like the idea of slapping the crap out of fairies, but... You know, do what you gotta do. They're still worth experience points, dammit. I also think their death cry is funny. I like the Outsider's death cries, and I like the Bloodbringer. Death Hello, what's this way? Oh, it's another part of the cathedral. Alright, so that was cool. It was worth an HP max up. I'm down for that. Now, it does appear, though, that I can't really go anywhere from here. I mean, yes, I could go down, but I want to keep exploring the Hall of Termination. <sighs> <All right. laughs> That in and of itself is an attack. And I bet you thought I forgot about the umbrella throw, didn't you? I mean, that costs MP as well, so I didn't forget about it. Yeah, you silly shit. What did you think was gonna happen there? I'm sorry, I find this one really funny. Something about that sound clip just fill just fills me with an amount of joy that's hard to describe. 
Oh, at last. It has to be. Oh, my. That's actually a worthwhile secret route. For once. So I gotta remember I can go back. Nice! It's weird, that actually has more... Stop trying to hit me with your butt. Hey, who do you think you are? Well, I mean, Dark Sage, she actually is using a stinger. It's not like she's just throwing her ass at you. I mean, yes and no. Agree to disagree. Sweet teleport spot. Sorry, Gamigan. MP Max up! You're a stupid sword! Really? I can go in there right now? Alright, tell you what, I am. It's a completely optional area, but I want to be strong enough to handle it right now. I'm not gonna lie, though, the answer is more than likely no, I'm not. Cyclone. Yeah, yeah. Well, she says that. It's very, very refined. It's kind of cyclone. That's not a save room. This is a save room. That's not a knife. This is a knife. That's not a knife. That's a spoon. All right, you win. Let's see, you've played knife and spoon. Ah, I'm a horse. Hello, Ika. Eat the nightmare. Oh. Okay, wow. Yeah, this area might be a little bit beyond my ability right now. <laughs> Enemies here are so strong. Hold on. God, she has such a high jump, too. Scarlet Bliss. Scarlet Bliss. There we go. I'm aware that her physical attacks are nothing to write home about, but. Unless I go a different direction. No, I kind of screwed myself up being able to ignore that. Oh. Yeah. Oh. That's oh. Stop it, Scarlet Bliss. Got it. 
Scarlet Rust. Oh. Scarlet Rust. Hold B for stronger attack. Alright, how in the world am I going to beat this guy? Quite an ordeal. I would honestly be surprised if I made it through this. I, I would appreciate the stronger Scarlet Frost, don't get me wrong, but. Scarlet Frost. Scarlet Frost. times, see if that helps. Because boy, do, boy do, do they do some damage. But I might be trying it again after. But you thought I forgot about that? Oh, 
Succubus, right? Okay, so I guess now it's time to look at the old map and figure out where I can go again. I haven't gotten any extra movement abilities. And I'm still being enticed by that strong so Against my better judgment, I'm going to give it one more try before I uh, before I call this episode done. Alright, right, this time instead of fighting everything, I will probably just skip over, skip over most of the enemies. Ah, 
Now what I'm not looking forward to is the advanced version of this attack. Stronger Scarlet Thrust. Also, he doesn't seem that difficult now that I understand his patterns a little better. And how to you and how to exploit them with Bloodless, but that's for next time. Right now, I want to thank you guys for watching, and hopefully you're hopefully you're okay with indulging me with doing a, day, a game other than huh, pardon me, Wizard of Legend. Ugh. Yeah, still a little sleepy, so I apologize, but. If you would be so kind, do me a favor by dropping me a like, leaving me a comment, showing me the love and support that you've been that you've been so kind as to shower me with over the last few months, and I will see you guys in the next video. My name is Dark Sage Walker, and I will be seeing you.